Another Day, Another Story. Rich Dad, Poor Dad, is a personal finance book written by Robert Kiyosaki. The book is based on Kiyosaki's personal experiences and the lessons he learned from his two fathers, his real father, Poor Dad, and his best friend's father, Rich Dad. Through contrasting the mindsets, beliefs, and financial habits of these two figures, Kiyosaki shares his insights on building wealth and achieving financial independence. The book begins with Kiyosaki recalling his childhood and how he grew up with two distinct role models for money. His real father, a highly educated and intelligent man, worked as a government employee and always struggled financially. Despite his job security and decent income, Kiyosaki's real dad lived paycheck to paycheck and often complained about not having enough money. In contrast, Kiyosaki's best friend's father, his rich dad, was a successful entrepreneur who built several businesses and accumulated significant wealth. One of the key differences Kiyosaki highlights between his two fathers is their approach to education. His real dad believed that a good education and a stable job were the keys to financial security. He encouraged Kiyosaki to study hard, get good grades, and pursue a high-paying job. Rich Dad, on the other hand, emphasized the importance of financial education, learning about money, and acquiring financial intelligence. Kiyosaki explains that Rich Dad taught him the importance of financial literacy, which involves understanding the language of money, such as income, expenses, assets, and liabilities. He emphasizes that financial education is not taught in schools and argues that this lack of knowledge contributes to people's financial struggles. According to Kiyosaki, being financially literate is a crucial step towards financial independence. The book introduces the concept of the cash flow quadrant, which categorizes individuals into four groups based on how they earn income, employees, E, self-employed, S, business owners, B, and investors, I. Kiyosaki explains that the majority of people fall into the E and S quadrants, where they trade their time for money, have limited control over their income, and are often stuck in a cycle of working hard to make ends meet. Kiyosaki emphasizes the importance of moving from the left side of the cash flow quadrant, E and S, to the right side, B and I. He argues that true financial freedom and wealth can be achieved by building businesses and investing in income-generating assets. The book encourages readers to shift their mindset from being an employee or self-employed to becoming a business owner or investor. To illustrate the power of investing in income-generating assets, Kiyosaki introduces the concept of, the rich don't work for money. He explains that many people work solely for a paycheck, whereas the wealthy focus on acquiring assets that generate passive income. Assets can include real estate, stocks, bonds, intellectual property, or businesses that generate cash flow. Kiyosaki emphasizes the importance of financial independence and achieving financial freedom. He encourages readers to redefine the concept of wealth beyond just the amount of money in their bank accounts. He argues that true wealth is measured by the passive income generated by one's assets, rather than the size of their paycheck. By focusing on building assets and generating passive income, individuals can achieve financial independence and have the freedom to choose how they spend their time. Another key lesson in the book is the distinction between assets and liabilities. Kiyosaki defines an asset as something that puts money in your pocket and a liability as something that takes money out of your pocket. 
He challenges the traditional notion of homeownership as an asset, arguing that unless the property generates income, such as rental income, it should be considered a liability. This perspective encourages readers to focus on acquiring income-generating assets rather than accumulating liabilities that require ongoing expenses. Kiyosaki also addresses the importance of mindset and overcoming fear. He explains that many people are held back from taking risks and pursuing financial independence due to fear of failure or criticism. He encourages readers to develop a mindset of resilience, persistence, and a willingness to learn from their mistakes. He highlights that failure is an essential part of the learning process and that successful people often have a history of failures before achieving their goals. The book discusses the power of financial goals and emphasizes the importance of setting clear objectives for oneself. Kiyosaki advises readers to define their financial goals and create a plan to achieve them. He suggests focusing on increasing passive income and reducing expenses to create a positive cash flow, which can be reinvested to acquire more income-generating assets. Kiyosaki stresses the significance of financial intelligence and lifelong learning. He encourages readers to continuously educate themselves about money, investing, and business. He suggests seeking mentors, attending seminars, reading books, and surrounding oneself with financially successful individuals to expand one's financial knowledge and mindset. In the final section of the book, Kiyosaki shares specific advice and action steps for readers to take on their path to financial independence. He encourages individuals to start small, take calculated risks, and not be afraid to make mistakes. He advises readers to develop their financial literacy by studying accounting, investing, and understanding how money works. Kiyosaki concludes the book by emphasizing the importance of taking control of one's financial future. He encourages readers to be proactive, think independently, and challenge conventional wisdom about money. He believes that by adopting the mindset and habits of the rich, anyone can achieve financial independence and build wealth. Overall, Rich Dad Poor Dad is a personal finance book that challenges traditional beliefs about money and provides a fresh perspective on building wealth. Through the contrasting stories of his two fathers, Robert Kiyosaki shares insights on financial education, asset acquisition, and the mindset required to achieve financial independence. The book encourages readers to shift their mindset, take control of their financial future, and strive for true wealth and freedom. Thank you for watching and please do like, share and subscribe.